In this video, we will go over the steps on how to insert a YouTube video into D2L. For the sake of this video, you should have already captured your lecture in the Rector building on the Rangeley campus, uploaded that video to YouTube, and now you're ready to make that video available for students to view in your D2L class. The steps to insert a lecture into D2L begin with uploading the video to YouTube. There is a previous instructional video on how to do this. Um, you will then need to copy the embed link from YouTube, create a page in the content section for the video, paste that embed link into the source for that content page, save the page, and then be sure to enable the content for students to be able to see it. So let's go through that process. In the previous video, we had uploaded a US history lecture. In this case, it was on World War II. As you can see here, it says upload complete. Your video will be ready at this particular link. So let's click on that link. And when we click on that link, notice it opens up a new tab. And here is the video that we want to put into D2L. So in the previous instructional video, we made this an unlisted video. And for that reason, we have to get the embed code in order to put that into D2L. To get that embed code, you just click on the share button right here and then scroll down and you click on embed. So this is the code that you want. And essentially it's already highlighted, so I can press control C um, or I can right click on it and say copy. Now let's go into D2L. So I'm gonna log into D2L by going to cncc.desiretolearn.com. I'm gonna put in my credentials to access my course. And now I'm going to go to that US history course to embed that particular link. So I'm clicking on the course, I'm gonna go into content, and I already have US and World War module set up. You can see here, I already have two lectures listed under this particular module. So for the new one, we're gonna click on new, create a file, and what we want is the source code behind this file. And that is indicated right here. We wanna to go to the HTML source editor. And we wanna put that embed code that we copied from YouTube in between these two body tags. So I'm going to right click and click paste. Command V on a Mac or Control V on a PC would also work. As you can see, now my video is listed right in there. I'm going to give it a title. Um, in this case, Lecture 3-30, World War II. Click Publish. And we can see the video. Students can see the video as well by just clicking the play. And they can watch the entire video. Now there is, an, on occasion, I'll show you here on the home page, that if you're in a browser that is trying to limit outside content, you might have seen that content right down there, that little yellow bar. We want to enable that content because I have an image here. So let's go over to content. And there's my World War II lecture. And let's see if it pops up. Well, it does pop up so we know we're good, but it's something that you might want to mention to your students that if they can't see the video, they need to make sure that their web browser will display um, insecure content. The only reason it's insecure is because it's coming from an outside source. And in this case, of course, we know that this video is safe to view. So that is it, and that completes the process for uploading a video to YouTube, and then also putting that video into your D2L course for students to see.